Alternative, I'm William Cook, and I see new Coheed and Cambria. I'm interested. Shoulders, we got a new song, official lyric video. Doesn't look like we have a music video quite yet, but I am excited to check this one out. Now, Coheed and Cambria, I've been with them since about 2013, the Afterman Descension. That album absolutely blew me away, and it remains to this day the best group of songs from, from these guys. A group of nine tracks, and I wouldn't I would say not a single song on this has me underwhelmed. I was absolutely blown away, especially with uh, Number City and oh, two's my favorite one. I think at uh, after all this time is the song that I keep the closest to me. That song is one of my all time favorite songs and the whole album is just wonderful. Never found anything that blew me away quite like that album from these guys. I did end up, that was enough to make me feel like, oh, I gotta go back and check out all of their older stuff. And they are a bit more rock strong than my tastes. Maybe, what, would you call them progressive? But still a band that I 100% keep my eyes on. Saw them in concert a couple of years back, which was awesome. I think it was on the tour for The Unheavenly Creatures. That was their 2018 album. And that song gave me, it was a strong album. And what was the song off of this one? That was just the big, big standout. Unheavenly Creatures, the title track. Yeah, oh yeah. Listen to this hook, man. Like, Son of a gun. And then he goes into that. You know, that's a song like that just keeps me encouraged that uh, Claudio Sanchez, the lead singer, right? Like, holy hell. First off, one of the greatest vocalists in rock today. And so good with the melody there, where some songs over there, you know, throughout what I've heard from them have been a little lacking for me on the melodic side, but that song is so exciting and how, what they do with that track is just unbelievable to me. Yeah. So I have a lot of, I still have a lot of faith in these guys to uh, supply me with some great stuff. Uh, and I'm excited to check out Shoulders here. Let's dive on in. Coheed and Cambria, Shoulders, what you got? So just a lyric video. Very nice looking lyric video though. Uh, the question is, it's heavy. Oh man, but are we gonna come through with a big melody on this one? Well, there's the melody, all right. I like the sound of that. And this riff here. I love when they just, oh, there you go. All right, all right. Could have been a harder, but all right. Is that some Predator stuff right there? See those masks? Listen to that voice! I like it, I like it. A quick a quick hook. 
Whereas when I was showing the Unheavenly Creatures song there before, it has the one part and then just goes in and it continues into like this other part of it and it's so, so good. And I love when a hook can do that. Okay, right back to the chorus. Keep my arms up until it hits. Two, three, no, no, keeping it going. Oh, this is getting awkward. Okay, the clap. Hit me, hit me, hit me, hit me, hit me. Look at that, man. That was a to the point type of track, you know? No messing around. And these guys, that's the thing for me. I'm an impatient listener, and I think I found the, the these guys aren't don't shy away from really stretching out a song. And uh, I am. I'm more into the radio rock friendly approach in a way with the song structure, verse, chorus, verse, chorus, bridge, chorus. And that was pretty much just verse, chorus, verse, chorus. And then right back into a better build for that final chorus and uh, without just kind of skipped through the bridge part. But I liked what they did with that final final chorus. And it hit pretty nicely, hit pretty nicely. It was pretty uh, good melodic drive to the hook. It wasn't a heavy hook. Uh, it didn't really grab me with the, the grit behind it, first listen, and I find a lot of times I'll do a reaction and when I play it back afterwards and stuff, I'm like, oh my god, you missed it, man, and you're missing out on uh, that, 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 maybe that extra power that you just can't quite grab onto sometimes with a first listen. Some songs you can feel it right away, some songs it does definitely take a, a few more listens. But uh, right off the bat, this is a great balance of their, their rock and their melody for a, a very solid sound and track that, yeah, for it looks like a lead single. Do we have an album announcement or what? Nothing here on an album, but for the first official single we've had from them in a few years here, uh, they came back with something pretty easy. They weren't uh, pushing many boundaries with this one. They just kept it right to that three minute range. And I'm happy with that. Something you can easily wrap your hands around. Cool stuff, Coheed. Thank you, and, and thank you for checking this out. Love a thumbs up if you liked what you saw. Hit the subscribe for more alternative content, and uh, leave your thoughts in the comments below. Let me know your thoughts on shoulders. If you got any requests, love to chat. I'll see you next time.